like a one big family. Hey? We understand each other's situation. Mm -hmm. We talk like we like, we just like brothers and sisters from the same mother when we are here. Maybe at home it's boring, you know. You come here to oh, refresh your oh, mind. It's, oh, it's packed. Like, yeah. We are a big whole family. Yeah. Then. Sitting you can around concentrate. the table. Exactly. Yeah. You know? Even you have a problem, we come together as teenagers and we talk. They guide us to the things that we're going to face in the future. Yeah. Yeah. The future is looking better for 160 children in Pimville, Soweto, who spend each day after school at the Boys and Girls Club of South Africa. It's the pilot project of an innovative program of activities and mentoring for children in disadvantaged communities. Supported by funders like Sasol, the club is a safe place for children to get homework help, learn life skills, and also have the fun that kids are supposed to have. In South Africa, there's, you know, teenagers face the same things that they're facing in, in, in the States and in other places in the world. You know, um, uh, drugs, alcohol, the pressure of, of school, and uh, this is where a Boys and Girls Club can really come in and make a difference. Connects caring adults with, with children. It's a safe haven for them to experience their childhood, but also to learn important um, uh, lessons and, and values in life. 50% of the South African population are under 20 years of age and they are at their most vulnerable um, then. So SASL has a youth development strategy that focuses specifically on youth at risk. Boys and Girls Club South Africa was a good fit. Instead of you being alone at home, being exposed to unwanted elements that you don't necessarily want to have, you have a program, you're kept busy and you're building skills at the same time. It's a good uh, organization because many, many children ha ha didn't have that chance of experiencing their talents that they have, like soccer, you know, drama. drama, you know, so most of the things you learn them from here. Every kid has to bring homework um, to the club. Um, if no homework, then they read a book. We do school projects where we use our media center. Then it's time for recreation. Soccer, there's drama, arts and crafts, and dance. I've learned to love, to respect, to share, to say please, to say thank you, and to say I'm sorry. And even also to communicate to people, to communicate with children, adults and teenagers, you know, on how you should talk to them. Everything that, that blocks me inside, I talk to them. The Boys and Girls Clubs of South Africa give children a safe and happy childhood and the skills and friends they need to become successful and productive adults. Uh, I won't be smiling today, being the person I am today. They've helped me a lot. You can change what's coming, but you can change how to, to live it. So, and like living the hard life in the future, you're going to be a better person, they told me that. And that's what keeps me going. It's a school for us, you know, because they teach us almost everything about life. 